So uh, my name is Stu Christie. I uh, work for Intel uh, for the developer relations program. So my job is to get people to write software for uh, these chips here. And today we've got a couple of our hexapod spiders running. Um, these are based on the Intel Edison system here and we've got a, a series of 18 uh, servos running each one of these. Um, they're running a LiPo battery and then we're connecting over Wi-Fi and uh, no, setting up the different patterns and uh, all the different modes that these things can do. These ones were originally set up for, as you can see here, a dance move for a, uh, a YouTube video. Um, so that's what they're doing there. So we're basing these uh, designs on the Intel Edison. So you can see this here. This is on the breakout board. And we've also got a larger board, the, uh, the Arduino style board, where you can see the Arduino connectors there, where you can plug in uh, a bunch of servos and sensors and everything. So we started with this one. Um, we added the pieces we needed to get the, the servos working. We shrunk it down to this, and now we've built a custom board uh, and plugged it on there. Now this is based on a design that uh, Matt Bunting from the University of Arizona developed. So we've 3D printed the pieces, um, he's written all the software, um, we're using our Yocto Linux distribution, um, and we've been taking these out to, uh, to roadshows and uh, you know, some of the Intel events um, to show people what they can build with the, with the Edison. So this is uh, now in the walking mode, we're rotating it. It's got a unique way of walking. I don't know if you noticed that the legs on either side of it look as though they're attached by what they call virtual springs. So this gives the robot some a uh, bit more uh, stability as it walks. It's similar to us pushing out a back leg so we don't fall over when we lean forward. Um, we've got our uh, disco moves here. Uh, we can change the color of the lights. So we got our favorite Intel blue here. Um, and then we got the fist bump that uh, the spider does there. And these moves, as I say, were originally developed for a music video um, that Matt Bunting um, helped feature the robots in. We'll bring it down, do the final hand bump. Um, and as I say, we can change all the colors of all, all of these LED. All of these servos are individually addressable. Um, so we can no, set up the, the multicolor mode on all of these as the pattern goes away. So if you're looking for more info, um, if you go to uh, intel.com slash edison getting started, you can get more info on the chip itself, or you can go to software.intel.com slash IOT, and uh, you get all the software and all the downloads to be able to build one of these yourself.